best thing about a public research university is that you get great undergrads and you have faculty members doing really neat research. Really anything that, that interests you, that could be your research topic and you have the chance here at UCLA to pursue it and get academic credit for it outside of the classroom while working with a faculty member. In one of my most recent projects, and in fact I had lots of undergraduates help me with that, I um, looked at whether welfare programs affected the well-being of children over their lifetimes. I had written a dissertation on the history of the United States Border Patrol. I did presidential advance, uh, vice presidential advance, uh, in the Bush Quail White House and then on the Bush Quail 92 campaign. Yeah, all as a part of this undergraduate research project that I, that I worked on in a medium politics class. And I've involved endless number of undergraduates in doing this, um, from finding the records to entering the records into Excel sheets. And I've continued with this work about policing and largely race and imprisonment um, in the U.S.-Mexico border region and now I'm working on a history of mass incarceration here in Los Angeles. There are two types of research projects. Students can work on a faculty-led research project, which means that the faculty member is researching something and the students can help the faculty member, or the students can find a project that interests them and ask a faculty member to mentor them. So essentially the students can create their own research projects. Unlike the anger baby phenomenon, which is undocumented mother crossing the border to give birth to a citizen, hopefully to stay. These birth tourists actually return to China with their child. So I look at how they construct the meaning of citizenship, how they even understand citizenship. Essentially, we look at um, stigma, we look at interactions between different groups, what we call intergroup interactions. Uh, so if, whether it is uh, individuals of different races, or uh, men and women, or uh, people who just have different uh, backgrounds and how they interact together. The Undergraduate Research Center for the Humanities, Arts, and Social Sciences is located in Murphy Hall on the A level. We offer workshops to help students get involved, workshops to help them manage their research project. We offer scholarship programs where students can do research and get scholarships in order to do research. Essentially, we are trying to help students take their research interests and, and run with them. I would really look for courses that have descriptions that involve writing research papers or getting your hands on data and doing things with data that have projects in them. You can get a tremendous amount of research experience just through choosing the right courses. And then always ask them, well, what are you researching right now? And listen to them, ask questions about the research, learn how they're doing what they do. You have to decide what your own goals are. And the only way to make that work is that you actually have to care and be really interested in what you're doing. We really encourage students to stop by the Undergraduate Research Center for the Humanities, Arts, and Social Sciences at any time. There are incredible research opportunities available here at UCLA, and our goal is to help students take advantage of them.